And again, welcome to worship. We're starting a new series here this morning. And it's all about who we are because Jesus is our Savior and Lord. It's kind of exciting, I hope. We'll find out. Let's worship together, beginning with the song, Since Jesus Came Into My Heart. Adopted 
sons and daughters. You are Christian. You are adopted. What's that mean? I will give you an example from my life. I was either a freshman or sophomore in high school. There was a big planned party in the woods. And I, not knowing much better at the time, went to ask my father if I could go to the party in the woods. Yes, you can imagine what the answer was. However, I asked. He said, no. I said, why not? He said, because I said so. And I came back with that classic line since time immemorial, but the other parents are letting their kids go. And he said, I'm not raising other kids. I'm raising you. That's adoption. Being singled out of the whole group for special attention and special care. And we have to be separated out of the group because in the group we're all sinners in need of a Savior. But when we are called by Jesus Christ and answers yes to the call, then we join the family of God, not because of anything we've done or anything we've earned or anything we've shown, but solely because of God's work. And so we're adopted. We have a different way of living in the world. How so? We live for his purpose. We view the world not as ours, but as God's. Life is about living with and for Jesus. Everything else will pass away soon enough, but that relationship will never leave. Our living then becomes a demonstration of our connection to our Savior and Lord. This is what adoption's like. God plucked us out of death and sin to be His. We are God's kids, not the world's kids, not the devil's children. Thanks be to God. Amen. There's not a better feeling to be able to say with heartfelt sincerity, in prayer, in music, now I belong to Jesus.
of a legal thing. The court has to get involved. Agencies have to make sure everybody's okay. With you, however, all that's desired, which motivated the adoption in the first place, is front and center. We've already been declared unfit and guilty. That's why Jesus went to a cross. But when he got off, he reached out those crucified hands and said, Touch me. Come with me. Be my brother. Be my sister. For we're family now by my blood. What a joy it is to know that we're not just wandering the world from one darn thing after another until we wander no more. But you are walking, and we pray, leading us to life and fellowship with you, and thus the joy of living for our Savior, our friend, our brother, Jesus. Amen. Amen. Your benediction for this morning is this. Once we were all kind of waifs, street rats, vagabonds, lost people, and many around us still are. But by grace, Jesus adopted you. You belong. Thanks be to God. Our benediction response is the tradition of this congregation. It's the song, May the Grace of Christ Our Savior. Mm -hmm.